It's so sparkly. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, we have been here for two and a half years. And it has been an amazing adventure. And as you can see, we have thoroughly filled this place to capacity over and over and over. The show has grown in ways I can't even imagine. Last week, I, I got called into the office across the way. And this isn't, this isn't uncommon. You know, it's a, during the performer's playground, it's a great opportunity to get a hold of me because it's, it's an unstructured moment. And our, our host for the last two and a half years, Nassif, said to me, he said, we're going to be closing for about a month and then we're gonna be doing some construction. And I said, well, what does that entail? He says, well, well, don't worry. And then he began to tell me the details. And at that moment, it became very clear that while we would still have a stage, we would lose so much of this playground space that it would be the opposite of what we wanted. Since the beginning of this event, I have, I have come here and there has never been a Monday night where I walked around at some point, I saw true creativity going on. People working together, collaborating, just doing anything they could to bring new things. And sometimes we saw them later that night. Sometimes we saw them weeks later. But we always saw good things come out of it. And I knew we, we couldn't do without that. I mean, this event doesn't work without, without that playtime. It's, it's, it's part of the heart and soul of it. And at that point, I was like, OK, we're done. That's the worst thing I've ever heard. And then I had to come back and do the second half of the evening. I, at the end of the night, I walked up to our production crew. Now, it's kind of funny, because our production crew used to be me and, and G, are you back there? Yeah. Used to be you and me, and, and it was the original videographer, Tim Stevens, and that was it. We did all the work, and then people went, you guys need help. <laughs> that crew is now a volunteer force of 20 people who work tirelessly every week to bring this event. <laughs> and they are, amazing and I told them all of this and they, they took a unanimous vote which of course I, I hadn't actually gotten to the part where I asked any questions they just sort of informed me that I was going to go find us a new home I haven't slept a lot in the last seven days I, I have spoken to every venue in the DFW Metroplex and I want to thank a bunch of people who also have been working tirelessly with me, creating lists of places for me to call and try to find the perfect home for this because I knew this thing is too good to make a downgrade move, a lateral move. We have to move up. We have to be that little goldfish that outgrows its bowl and then we chuck it into a big pond to find out what happens. Friends, I have found us an ocean. Tonight is our last night at the House of Poets, and let me be clear that this venue has been amazing. We were promised six months here on our original contract. We have been extended until now. This place, you guys, you guys are amazing. Starting next Monday, and I know everybody's reaching for a pen, don't worry, there are maps that have been secretly placed out front. Make sure you get one before you go. Starting next Monday, we are moving your five minutes of fame five miles up the road. Celebration Event Center in Plano, Just Up Custer, has agreed to not only host this event, but to do it in a way you couldn't imagine. We will have four times the space. They are a theater center. They are ideologically a, a, a perfect match. We've cheated death. We're gonna change. The event's gonna mess around and it's gonna be a mess for a couple of weeks while we figure out how to, where all the buttons are, are and we press them and new things happen. But like a new girlfriend. But we realized it was far more important to sustain this event without a hiatus than it was to take a month off and come back perfect. So we have worked a Faustian quality deal to bring you a new home. On your way out, please make sure you, you pick up a map. Make sure you're with us next week to come see this amazing new space. I know everybody has a thousand questions. We're going to start the Performer's Playground up at the beginning of the, the thing that comes after that. I will be 
doing a very different kind of lightning round where I answer as many questions as I can. But I don't want to take any more of your time in the playground, which is the most important thing that happens at this event. Thank you so much for coming. The playground is now open.